a very good morning to all of you welcome to ANB exam forum student in general science portion there is one topic called computer and IT in today's session we are going to cover that section and uh, we have seen one or two questions from this topic as well uh, in this particular exam okay so in today's session we are going to cover 35 MCQ in 35 minutes okay so without wasting any time let's begin the session so this is a syllabus that we have in the detailed advertisement the first uh, topic is basic and knowledge and fundamental about computer about word processing spreadsheet generation of slide and email etc so this is a open-ended etc means anything they can ask from uh, the computer and IT related portion okay so be settled uh, we are beginning the session so the first question is on your screen and your time starts now in a computer system which device is functionally opposite to keyboard a very simple one student keyboard as you know it is a input device it is an input device and if you see out of these four option printer is the output device okay so it is functionally opposite to the keyboard so option D is the right answer okay let's move to the next question the popular search engine Google derived its name from the word Google okay Google what does this word mean student as you know Google we use left and right in our daily life but the initial uh, it was known as Google okay and the word Google means the number followed by hundred zero num numeral one followed by hundred zero is called Google okay so option D is the correct answer let's see the next question who can give the answer arithmetic and logical unit first perform arithmetic operation stores data perform comparison communicate with input device which of the following is true okay so ALU it is also known as ALU arithmetic and logical unit so as the word suggests arithmetic so it will definitely perform arithmetic operation logic means uh, comparison basically logic means if if that if not that if this then this okay that is basically nothing but comparison so option 3 is also good this unit in the computer does not store any data generally data is stored in some form of memory it can be permanent or temporary memory communicate with the input device it is no way related so we have option D 1 and 3 is the correct one so those who have given option D well and good next question uh, this is a very simple one so in computers the one terminology bit is there what is that bit okay it is binary informatics bilingual information bilingual terminator binary digit so basically it's binary digit so that's bi and the from digit it's t so binary digits binary digit means it can have only two options binary means two either zero or one and these are digits so this is basically binary digit and in short it is known as bit so option d is the right answer let's see the next question let's see who can give the answer so in the internet we use the term url okay what does this url mean uniform resource locator okay it is uniform resource locator option a is the correct answer it is not unique reform uh, resource locator i have seen some of the people are giving this answer this is not the correct okay so option a is the correct answer let's see the next question booting the system means what okay and your time starts now these are the four options loading the operating system dismissing the computer running an application a program called booting physically kicking the computer physically kicking the computer is straight away you can reject it so you are left with option three option dismissing the computer is also you can eliminate it is nowhere related to booting so you are left with option a and c so if you are not computer savvy so you might be confused between these two options 
okay uh, you will definitely choose option c because it has word booting but it is incorrect option a is the right one so what happens this is your hard disk in hard disk there will be an operating system okay and this is a your ram random access memory so booting is nothing your os is get loaded into the ram is known as booting so loading the operating system is called booting the system okay so option a is the correct answer where is india's supercomputer param is located okay a very good one student india supercomputer param is located in cdac pune it is cdac pune okay more precisely param 8000 okay so option b is the correct answer so uh, there is one terminology in computer ic okay what does this ic means okay it is very co common in electronics field so those who are from electronics background they can easily tell what does this ic means and those who don't know just remember it is known as integrated circuits okay it has all the it is basically a chip which have lots of gates resistor transistors okay so that is called integrated circuits so option c is the right answer let's see the next question which of the following is an ascending order of data hierarchy he is telling ascending ascending means short uh, shortest to the largest okay so as i told you earlier that bit is the shortest one so you can straight away eliminate these two so you are left with this okay bit combination of bit is byte combination of byte is field it is not record so option c is also eliminated so straight away you can tick option d okay so option d is the right answer the person known for communication revolution in india is o oh, okay these are the four option varghese kurian is no way related to communication kv kamath it is somewhat related to economics pc manabal is a some way from the statistic so we are left with sam petroda and sam petroda is the right answer let's see the next question speed of microprocessor is measured in nowadays all our computer savvy because all have uh, mobile in their hands so as you know the speed is measured in gigahertz or megahertz so option b is the right answer a very very simple one but although you, if you are not computer savvy you might get wrong what is a brain of computer called a very simple one it is called cpu center processing unit central like our brain has central nervous system so computer has central processing unit it is called brain of computer not motherboard okay generally student confuse with motherboard so but the correct answer is option c cpu which of the following computer memory is non volatile student you should know the term non volatile there are two memories volatile memory and non volatile non volatile means once power is off uh your memory will retain the data in it okay and in volatile if power is lost your data is also lost so all the rams are basically volatile but where rom whereas rom is a non volatile so option d is the correct answer who invented world wide web let's see who can give this answer charles babbage as we know he is known as father of computer Martin Cooper is uh, somewhat related to internet whereas R Samuel Tomlinson he i think he has uh, generated he has invented email and whereas Tim Berners-Lee he he is also known as TBL Tim Berners-Lee he has invented world wide web so option B is the right answer RAM is used as short memory so it is used as short memory so what does this mean short so as i told you short means whenever there is a power in it it will have data once power is lost data is lost so it is called volatile and volatile means it is a short memory so option a is the right answer father of computer a very simple one all of you know that it's charles babbage he has made analytical computers so a 
वेरी लॉन्ग बैक सो ही इज कंसिडर्ड एज फादर ऑफ कंप्यूटर सो ऑप्शन सी इज द राइट आंसर वट डज दिस टर्म गीगो रिलेटेड टू दीज आर द फोर ऑप्शन सो इफ यू नो द एब्रीविएशन गीगो देन यू कैन ईजली आंसर दिस क्वेश्चन गीगो स्टैंड फॉर गार्बेज इन गार्बेज आउट वट डज दिस मीन यूर दिस इज योर पीस इफ यू आर फीडिंग रॉन्ग इनपुट इट विल गिव रॉन्ग आउटपुट इफ यू आर फीडिंग राइट आउट इनपुट सो इट विल फीड इट विल गिव राइट आउटपुट सो बेसिकली इट इज एक्यूरेसी सो ओके सो इफ यू आर गिविंग एक्यूरेट इनपुट इट विल जनरेट एक्यूरेट रिजल्ट सो ऑप्शन डी इज द करेक्ट आंसर वन के बी इज इक्वल टू हाउ मेनी बिट्स ओके यू शुड नो द दिस नंबर्स ओके सो स्टूडेंट रिमेंबर वन बिट एज आई टोल्ड यू इज जीरो एंड वन एंड इफ देर आर एट बिट्स इट इज कॉल्ड बाइट्स ओके देन आफ्टर बाइट वी हैव किलो बाइट किलो इज नॉट थाउजेंड स्टूडेंट रिमेंबर इट इज नॉट ऑप्शन बी इट इज नॉट ऑप्शन डी इट इज नॉट फाइव हंड्रेड ट्वेल्व इट इज वन जीरो टू फोर बाइट्स ओके वन किलो बिट ही इज सेंग किलो बिट इट इज नॉट सेंग किलो बाइट्स सो वन जीरो टू फोर बिट्स ओके सो ऑप्शन सी इज द राइट आंसर the term used to describe person who spent plenty of time in online exploring the internet so nowadays all of us are these person who are doing a lot of uh, time in the internet and it is called net addicts okay so option a is the correct answer we are all net addicts whereas who loves a computer he is known as cyberphile okay cyberphile so option a is the correct answer for this question a very simple one what does bio stand for whenever you see in it or computer io it is generally referred to input and output so when if you see input and output is there yes this is input and output so option d is the right answer which application in microsoft office is feasible for preparing a presentation okay as you know microsoft powerpoint this presentation it is itself in powerpoint so microsoft powerpoint is used for making presentation where if you want to make a document it is in microsoft word where if you want to do some calculations you want to do some mathematical operation then access excel will be there if you want to publish some articles then publisher will be the application the section of cpu uh, that selects interpret monitor and execution of the program instruction okay so he went much more deeper so cpu has one unit called control unit okay he basically interprets selects and execute the instruction just remember this control unit where is arithmetic and logical unit as i told you it perform arithmetic and logic operation register and memory stores the data okay so option c is the right answer in mx excel provide visual uh, representation of value in worksheet okay so one question from ms excel so visual representation from the option you can see chart with the help of chart uh, we can visually represent any data in excel quickly coming to the next it is from the board the alignment at beginning at the end of the line is referred to indentation justification superscript font as you know this is a document so if you are aligning with uh, beginning and aligning at the end this is called justification it is not indentation it is justification so option b is the right answer which was the first electronic computer constructed at moore school of engineering a very simple one this is a very old electronic numerical integrator and computer okay so eniac is the first computer okay so option c is the right answer the face generated by the end of person computer is known as a very simple one nowadays everybody is talking about e waste e waste e waste is e is electronic waste okay so electronic waste is a waste generated by the end life of the person computer so option d is the right answer quickly moving to the next question which of the following is a uh, system software so th there are two kinds of software application software and system software okay 
all these database word process spreadsheet these are application software whereas compiler is a translator which convert high level language to low level language is basically your system software let's see the next question the programs stored in rom are called software firmware freeware none of these so student remember rom is a read only memory so if software is burnt into that read only memory for the first time it is called firmware okay so option c is the right answer in which of the following area spreadsheet is more useful these are the four area as i told you spreadsheet is doing uh, used for doing some calculation if you don't know about excel okay so from these options statistic is a field where you have lot of uh, calculation lot of uh, operations are there so option c is the right answer quickly moving to the next question pda stands for what these are the four option this is very obsolete uh, nowadays this is very obsolete now nobody is using pda pda stands for personal digital assistant okay so option a is the right answer a very simple one virus is a program a uh, virus is a computer that is what chemical that attacks silicon it is not a physical activity microorganism it is not a, again an organism living thing it is basically a program that damages the computer software okay nowadays uh, everybody is computer saving so these are very simple questions let's see the next question a collection of picture that can be inserted in document is called so if you are using ms word excel so you should know that the answer is clip art so clip art is a gallery where you have all the clips all the pictures in it who developed the concept of email uh, I, as i told you earlier it is ray tomlinson so remember it is email okay email email is the right answer the device which convert digital signal to analog signal at the start of long distance transmission okay so generally on wires we uh, do analog signal because it is cost effective whereas uh, digital signal is used by the computer okay digital signal so if you are doing internet uh, so you need to convert that analog signal to digital so suppose this is your fiber net or wifi whatever you are getting it is basically an analog signal so you need to convert into digital for digital conversion we require modem okay so this is modulation demodulation okay so option b is the correct answer we are done so i think uh, we have covered 35 question within 35 minutes so we have not wasted your time i request all the student uh, who are watching us uh, this video uh to subscribe our channel we will definitely give more videos for your preparation so thank you for watching and have a nice day